An equation is an expression with an equal sign. An open sentence has a variable in it. Open sentences are types of equations. So for example, state whether each equation is true. If it's true, it means the left hand side equals the right hand side. If it's false, it means the left hand side does not equal the right hand side. And if it's open, it means it has a variable in it. So the first one, I don't see a variable, so it's not open. So now we're going to see if it's true or false. So 6 plus 14 is 20. Does that equal 20? 20 equals 20. So the equation or the example is true. Letter B, I see a variable in it, so it's open. Letter C, I don't see a variable, so it's not open. But the left-hand side is 24, and the right-hand side is 32, so that's false. So equations can either be true or false or open, has a variable in it. Here are a few more. So I don't see a variable, so it's not open. 9 minus 7 is 2. 2 does not equal 3, so this is going to be a false equation. Letter B. I don't see a variable, so it's not open. 20 divided by 4 is 5. Does 5 equal 5? It does, so it's true. And the last one has a variable, so it's open. Example, write an equation, so it needs to have an equal sign. Then determine if it is true, false, or open. So the key word that you have to look for is is means equals. So we're going to write nine times nine times the opposite of five so that's negative five is it's equal sign 45 45 so now we're going to evaluate it and see if it's true false or open well nine times negative five is negative 45 negative 45 does not equal 45 so this is a false equation. False. B, 20 minus x is equals 3. Is this true, false, or open? It's open because it has a variable in it. Another vocab term, a solution to an equation is a number for the variable that makes an equation true. So a solution is if you substitute or if you change or if you plug in that number for x or the variable, it's true. So for example, is 30 a solution? to the equation 20 plus x equals 50. So if we let x equal 30, is this statement true? So let's try it. Does 20 plus, now I'm going to plug in 30, 30 equal 50? Does 50 equal 50? Yes, it does, so it's a solution. So I write yes. 
it is a solution. B. A diver's equipment weighs 35 pounds. The diver plus the equipment weighs 165 pounds. So the diver plus the equipment, which we know is 35 pounds, is or weighs 165 pounds. Can the diver's weight, so that's D, can D be 200? So we're going to plug in D equals 200 and see if it's true. So does 200 plus 35 equal 165? No, it doesn't. The left hand side doesn't equal the right hand side. Now we're going to try these quick checks. Is the number given a solution to the equation? So and that means, can we plug in the number for the variable and have it be true? So the first one, let m be 6. So 9 minus, now I'm going to plug in 6. Does that equal 3? Does 3 equal 3? Because 9 minus 6 is 3. Yes, it's a solution. B, t equals 1. So whenever you see a t, write 1. So is a plus t times 1 equal to 2 times 1? Oops, I didn't mean t times 1. I meant 8 plus 1. So 8 plus 1 equal 2 times 1. Does 9 equal 2? No, so it's not a solution. And the last one. A tent weighs 6 pounds. Your backpack and tent together, so it means plus, weigh 33. So the tent is 6 pounds. Your backpack, we don't know, so we'll call that B, weighs 33. Right, use an equation to find whether the backpack weighs 27. So can we substitute 27 in here? So now we have 6 plus 27 equals 33. Well, 33 equals 33. Yes, the backpack can weigh 27 pounds.